everyone welcome back or to my channel in today's video i'm basically going to be showing you guys how to refill your wallflower scent um things from bath and body works and how to put it together and all that type of stuff so let's get started okay so the first thing you want to do is unplug your wallflower And once you've unplugged it, all you're going to do is basically take whatever you have and just turn it to the right and it will start to get loose. And this is basically done. They last around one to three months. This one lasts around, I would say, around two months. And once it's like this, this is basically garbage now. So you can recycle this. And now you're left with basically your plug-in um, part of where it goes into. So I have three scents right here. I have an autumn one, I have a frosted cranberry one, and a eucalyptus rain. I'm gonna be using this one today, but anyone works. And once you have your scent, all you have to do is just take off this plastic part here, this rubbery part, and you can keep this like on your fridge or on your desk to know like what it is, like what the scent is if you forgot, or you can just throw it out. That's what I'll be doing today. And once you have your scent, all you have to do is just take off this plastic wrap. Be very careful because this is glass, so you don't want to drop it or anything. And now I have this off. So the next thing you're gonna do is take the white or black part. I know some of them are black, but take your the, this part right over here and just turn it to the left. And that basically opens it up. And then once you have your scent open up, all you have to do is basically take it and put it in. So just fit it in. And now you're just gonna turn it to the left. And once you have it in, all you have to do is basically just plug it in. So when this becomes empty again, um, all you have to do is just turn it right and that will basically unlock it. And if you're putting a new one in like I did today, you're gonna turn it left. And once you have that, it's pretty much done. So you're basically just gonna plug it right back into the wall. And just make sure it's tight. And don't make it too tight, don't force it or anything because I don't want it to like explode or anything. And once it's like that, there you go. You have your wallflower. I hope you guys learned from this video. If you have any questions, um, let me know in the comments down below. I will answer any questions that you guys have if I didn't explain anything in today's video. Um, hopefully you guys got the gist of it. Today's video was really short because it's just a how-to tutorial. If this helped you out, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll be doing more tutorials on my channel. And yeah, don't forget to press that red subscribe button down below. Turn the little notification bell right beside it. And that basically notifies you every single time I upload a new video. Don't forget to share this video with anyone that has one of these wallflowers because in case they forget how to use it, this will be a great video to watch. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!